Hi, this is Brandy, and welcome to Fantastic Fiber Friday. The fiber of the week this week was Dorset, and um, I found out there were two types of Dorset that come from the Dorset region of England, and the type of Dorset I'm talking about is the horned or polled Dorset, and I had done up some of the fiber in that um, wood rose colorway from last week and a little spinning and this is how it spun up I was able to get that nice cloud pretty fine and it looks really really nice I can't wait to spin up the rest of it I kinda like how it's just slightly tonal very nice so, if you want to learn more about Dorset Sheep and Dorset Fiber, check out Monday and Wednesday's blog. I had done some spinning this week, but not a whole lot. Um, I started on one of my other colorways. This is the Sherbert colorway. And it has, the wool is done in a pink. And the mo I did mohair in orange and the Firestar in yellow. And it reminded me of Sherbert ice cream, so that's how the name came about. And it's spinning up quite nicely. I got one ounce of it spun up on this bobbin. And I can't wait to see how four, four ply in this looks, because that's my plans with that. And the reason there's so little spinning this week is because I have been doing a lot of knitting and crocheting. I actually joined a uh, crochet along, which I don't often do, but I really like the pattern. It's, uh, it's the Summer Lion Brown Crochet Along, and it's a shrug. And I've started mine. Of course, I changed everything about it. I changed the, the yarn type and the whole bit, so I basically rewrote the whole pattern for my yarn. And this is the top half of the shrug, and, and here's one sleeve going to the other sleeve. It wraps right around the back. And I picked some random yarn I had found at Marden's. I think it's probably Red Heart Shimmer or something like that. And it's, it's a nice soft feel in yarn, so I thought this would be, and very light, so I thought it would be very nice for summer. So I am doing that crochet along. I also have been able to put a few rows in on my Claris by Laura Nelkin. And this is part of that um, lace knitting class I took with her. And she's right. Lace looks like crap until you block it. So it's looking like crap, but it's, it's getting more rows on it. And I did put quite a few rows on my Went Berrying shawl that I have been working on. Uh, my friend Michelle Knitter, Michelle Miller, also known as the Fickle Knitter. <laughs> Michelle Knitter, well, she is a knitter, but anyway. <laughs> um... This is her Went Berry and Shaw I have been working on, and I've really been enjoying this knit. It's just a lot of fun. So that's why there is so little knit spinning this week and a lot of knitting and crochet that have gotten done. And I figured I should give everybody an update on the kittens. So we'll go to that in just a moment. My goodness, we got kitties trying to kill each other. <laughs> My goodness. Vicious, vicious little kitties. What are you guys doing? Hi, poor chap. <laughs> and Houdini's like, no, you're not going. I gotta get my digs in first. What are you doing? <laughs> and that is a moment with the kittens. Weren't they adorable? They're growing up pretty darn fast. I want to talk about something I'm kind of excited about that's going on this next coming week. Um, my friend Nicole Snow over at Darn Good Yarn is having an open house. And I have been invited to bring my fibery stuff from the fiber of my bean and my spindles to give mini spinning lessons. So if I don't know how many of my viewers are in this area, but if you're going to be in the Dover Foxcroft, Milo, um, Sebec area, 
feel free to drop in. The open house is from 12 p.m. to 4 p.m. And you can find more information on that at www.darngoodyarn.com. And hope to see you there. On a little more of a serious note, this is a special weekend. This is a holiday weekend. It's Memorial, more Memorial Day weekend. And many of my family members and both of my husbands have been in the military or still are in the military. My son is, is pointing at me. Oh, the shawl. <laughs> no, keep it going. Keep it going. Let it go. Let the mistake stay this time. Um, this little shawl that I made, I did make from Darn Good Yarn Stock, just to get an idea of how much fun this yarn is. I love the colors. And I have made all kinds of stuff for it. And this pattern will be available soon. Um, Nicole will have it in her hands shortly. But, I think I've got a piece of fiber in my mouth. I do. Um, but, what fun, you know? What bright, vibrant color, what fun. I enjoyed making it, and I'm even I'm really enjoying wearing it. Okay, back to Memorial Day weekend. Um, this week I am a part of the I am a part of the American Legion Ladies Auxiliary. I didn't know if I could spit that out. <laughs> and what we're doing this weekend, we're having our junior girls auxiliary sell poppies to help benefit the veterans. We do things for them like go to the veterans home and um, have ice cream socials with them and spend time with them. So if you're out at your parade wherever you're at and you see people running around selling poppies, give a donation for a poppy. It's going for a good cause. And on that note, I'm going to close this up and I hope you guys have a great weekend and I will see you next week.